Represented on the table today are two of Leatherman's finest keychain multi-tools. Hey guys, I'm the late Boy Scout, and this is going to be my review of the Leatherman Squirt PS4. It's been on the market for a while. Most of you guys have seen it already. I'm going to give you my two cents on the tool. As I do that, I'm going to compare and contrast it with the Squirt P4. Not represented on the table today is the Squirt S4, which is, you know, the other version of the Squirt from days gone by. You'll see that in annotation here and in uh, cutaway. The Squirt P4, however, is the one with pliers, and we'll go through its complement of tools really quickly. You've got a little awl there, a punch, a very useful one. You've got a nice little small flathead screwdriver, okay, good for eyeglasses. A nice two-dimensional Phillips head screwdriver. Yes, it works. It works all right. This is another flathead and also bottle opener. The bottle opener sucks, but the flathead works all right. You've also got your file from metal and or wood. And you've got a very nice 420HC drop point chisel ground knife. They do actually a very good job with these knives. Honestly, in my opinion, they're, you can't ask for much more. For a simple EDC blade, I actually use this more than most of the EDC blades I have, the one that I have on my uh, keychain tool, because it just doesn't bother anybody. You know what I'm saying? You get this out, nobody's alarmed by it, and you can get a little quick work done, a little box opening or whatever it is you have to do. And it's actually pretty sharp, and it gets very sharp. If you've got even a tiny bit of knife sharpening skills, you can get this thing razor sharp, and it'll stay that way for a little while. So Leatherman's treatment of the 420HC uh, steel that they put that they use for their knives and these tools is actually very good, and I'm very happy with it. So the Leatherman S4, let's talk about that for a moment, was the tool, and I'll show you some of those features on that tool now, is the one that's the scissors version of this, okay? And it's also sort of geared more towards personal grooming and, um, you know, those sorts of needs. Whereas the P4 is more for handyman type stuff, but very light duty handyman stuff. So for a long time you had to choose. Do I want the one with scissors and all that complement of tools, or do I want the one with pliers and its complement of tools? You don't have to make that choice anymore. What you get now is the Squirt PS4, but yes, you make some sacrifices. Let's compare and contrast just these two. What do we lose by gaining scissors? And let's show those to you real quickly. By gaining these scissors, and they're capable scissors, by the way, more so than I thought they would be. Quite sharp, quite effective, they work really well. What we have in this complement of tools is, again, the two-dimensional Phillips head screwdriver with a very nice fine tip on it that actually doubles as a, um, actually doubles as this very, uh, very delicate and fine flathead. Okay, it actually works quite well as that. This is great for eyeglasses. This is actually really good for eyeglasses too. Cool. You've also got the flathead and bottle opener, the file for wood and metal, and I think that's it. So what did we give up? Well, we gave up the awl. And boy, did we ever. That actually comes in really handy and did would have been handy for me if I'd had this one on me. Instead, I had this one. I needed to drill a hole in a belt. And uh, how did I do it? Couldn't use this. This would have been great. I ended up using this, the two-dimensional Phillips. I got through it, but I much would much rather would have had this. Okay. Of course, the uh, if you're thinking about the S4, it's got a completely different complement of tools which, you know, very few of those are represented here on the PS4. So, yes, it does combine the pliers and the scissors, those two very basic tools that anybody with a keychain tool is probably going to want. But you do make some sacrifices, you do have to give up um, some of the other complements of tools, and that's just going to be the way it is. Even so, sacrifices aside, the Squirt PS4 is still quite a nice pocket-sized, keychain-sized multi-tool. I really like it. And honestly, if I were to do it all over again and just get one, 
I could see why the PS4 would be the one you'd want to get. Well, that's my review. I'm the late Boy Scout, guys. Thank you so much for watching. We'll see you on the next one.